MicroStation Essentials Partial Delete and Break Element Partial Delete and Break Element are element modification tools. They work on existing elements. Partial Delete allows you to remove an unwanted portion of an existing element. The Partial Delete changes slightly in its operation based on the element type you've chosen to partially delete. Break Element is relatively straightforward. It allows you to break an element into two pieces without removing any part of that element. Let's see how these commands work within MicroStation. First you'll find the partial delete and break element under the modify element task in the main task. As you can see partial delete has no tool settings. Really it's mostly based on the type of element you choose. So if I go to a open element like a line then the first point establishes the start point for the partial delete. And the second data point or left mouse button click establishes the end point of the partial delete. As you can see, you can delete all or part of an element here using partial delete. It also works on closed elements. So for example, if I go and take a look at the block here, I can use the partial delete command to select the start point for the partial delete. Now I need to choose a direction that I'm going to go. So this will allow me to go in a specific direction. And this is also allows me to choose the end point of the partial delete. So with a closed element, the first point starts it, and then you've got to choose which direction you're going to go. And the second mouse button click completes the partial delete. This is also true of something like a circle which allows you to choose which direction you're going to go. The break element tool is relatively straightforward. It allows you to break an element by point at a specific location. This is also found in the modify task and the main task. So here you're just simply going to choose the point at which you break an element. This is now two different elements. broken into two parts. When you start off it's one piece. When you use break on it, it's now two pieces. This is true of any type of element that you choose including a closed shape. So, partial delete and break element. Partial delete allows you to remove an existing portion of a element that is unwanted. The operation varies slightly depending on the element type chosen. Break element allows you to break an element into two pieces without removing any part of it.